running back, Travis Homer. Travis, what's the atmosphere like for the team this week coming off the loss? Uh, we know that that loss is big on us, but we're, we, we know that we got locked in this week and we're just going to give it all at practice. Travis, what's been the, the, the trouble uh, establishing the run game in the first half the last few weeks? What, what areas would you point to for why that's been the case? Has that been an emphasis? Uh, I mean, I usually just let that let Coach Searle see that and talk to them, but I just think that we just got to get a feel of how they're moving and everything. Travis, have you noticed uh, any difference in the league uh, since you got benched last week? I, th I think he's more focused now. And I'm not saying that he wasn't focused before, but I, it's just that extra. Is it being more of a vocal leader at practice? Now? Oh, yeah. Clemson, what kind of challenge did they present at the defense? Clemson, what oh. kind of challenge did they present to you guys? I know that they're fast and strong, you know, they have a good defense, and that they're very disciplined, so. How ready do you think Michael Irvin is, you know, to step in for Chris? Obviously, Chris did so much for you guys offensively. How ready do you think Michael is for that challenge? I know Mike's been, uh, he's been studying like all season, so I think I think he's ready to step up. You think the, the, the challenge of being there in Charlotte, just kind of it being a big game, you think that'll affect him at all? No, I don't think he's really going to have any effect on that. Uh, I know we ask you this every week, but the college football playoff rankings come out tonight. It's, uh, it's I, the next to the last one. All, I, all we need to do is just win our games, and that's it. You think that that's going to be enough to get into the playoffs? Even if it's not, it doesn't matter to us. We're just going to do go out there and do what we need to do. Thank you, Travis. Thank you. Thanks, Travis.